Hello guys, Yusuf Steve here, and with me today, of course, is... Bill Dre from Heroes Guild Games, and today we're bringing you uh, the Dreamier adapt the Dreamier archetype, which has gone, uh, announced uh, more support in, what, Chaos Impacts for us? Uh, yes, Chaos Impact for us. Yeah. So, you know, I'm super hyped. Uh, I've loved this deck, even when it was, uh, unplayable. <laughs> yeah, we have, uh, we have, like, two whole videos of, tr of him trying to make this deck work with, before its original support, and, uh, yeah. It was only one video. I can and see I didn't make a second one because of that. <laughs> because I could make the deck work afterwards. But yeah. now the deck is playable to a point. I wouldn't call it like... Good. Yeah, I, I mean, it could be good, I guess, in a sense. Maybe not high like, tier good. It's not It's not like it's dangerous or not shit. Definitely not sure. even tier 2 good. Might be tier 3, and you know, at best. Yeah, it, it's probably good for casuals. That's yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, where um, I put it at. So yeah, uh, can you explain to some of these, can you explain to our viewers like what the Dream Mirror is supposed to do? Okay, so the Dream Mirror is, the whole effects are based around having your field spells. You have, a, you have the Dream Mirror of Terror and the Dream Mirror of Drawing. So the light ones can tag out into the dark ones when Terror is on the field, and the, and the dark ones tag out into the light ones when Joy is on the field. And they tag out into each other, so each one has the counterpart. So here's the Dark Knight, and here's the White Knight. They're both Morpheus, this one's dark, one's white. And then you have your you have your good boys, you have your dark good boy and your light good boy. Uh, they tag out into each other, and then the fairies down here tag out into each other. And when they and when most of them are special memory, they affect the Dream Mirror uh, monster. monster. They gain in effect. Like he would pop a card, he makes himself indestructible. He's probably like one of the worst ones. Unfortunately, uh, foe allows himself to attack directly. A uh, friend allow a uh, friend gives you one back from the graveyard. Um, Mara special summons from hand, and Sprite searches your deck for any Dream Mirror card. So she she doesn't just search monsters. I honestly wish that uh, she was a fucking uh, one for one target, so you know the effect actually goes off. But yeah. unfortunately, I mean by technicality, she's a one for one target. She doesn't gain her effect from one for one. Which I hate that they have you special summoned by a Dream Mirror monster, not a card, but a yeah. monster. Uh, they they should just gain their effect on special summon. The deck would be so much better. Yeah, it might have been playable with four support. To be honest, but if they could just gain their effect and mean special summon, because you could work around some of the stuff. <laughs> yeah, but. and then of course their other uh, their other trap their other trap support mm -hmm. their trap spell trap support is uh, pretty decent. Chaos is essentially uh, flash fusion for them. And yeah. depending on which mirrors are on the field, as in both sides of the field, because one of their cards lets you put uh, one mirror on your po one field spell on your opponent's side of the field and one on your own. And then um, they also have they have a counter trap that we're not using because it's just a worse version of Judgment, honestly. Which, to be fair, it might also just be because YGO Pro d didn't like when I tried using this in, in playtesting. Because it would always, it always just glitch out. Yeah, so we'll, we'll, we'll take a break on it. I mean, okay, so here's the big downside to the deck. If y'all couldn't figure out from hearing it, your whole deck is based around these six cards right here. If you don't have a field spell, your cards are all almost bricks. Except for Hypnogia, which gives you the field spells. Uh, this can search any monster where your monsters can't do anything without the field spells. And secondary effects are based on your field spells. And this is a flash fusion, but you need your light field spell to be able to fuse from your hand and your dark field spell to be able to fuse from your graveyard. Uh, honestly, you want the dark field spell on the field when you use um, chaos because you can just banish from the graveyard, which is better than yeah. you know being a basic fusion spell. But it's quick place; so you can use it during the battle phase, so it's good. Um, fantasy has to have two of your field spells banished for it to be able to be used. Um, in the graveyard, you can banish it to protect your dream mirror card cards. And then uh, oh, oh, no, you also you also forgot fantasy. Uh, you forgot fantasy the effect where you you know you just you shuffle the two uh, banished field spells. You just not targeting banish a card in the field. Yeah, bye well, bye. You well, that's what I'm saying. It relies on your field spell being banished. True. So that's what I was trying to say. Everything in this archetype except for this card relies on having the field spells. So that's why I'm not running this over just running two judgments. Uh, simply because I would have to have one field spell to use one effect and the other field spell to use the other effect. And both to use to even have the option of using both effects, but I could just have a judgment and have both effects. <laughs> yeah, well, and besides, who needs life points when you're when you're running jank? And then of course you have to you have to run BLS because otherwise your deck has like no offensive options. Honestly, yeah. I mean, I feel like it would have offensive options. Keep in mind, we haven't like I haven't fully tested this build yet, but I think BLS helps with some of the offense. 
But I mean, keep in mind, like, if you hit Nogia, the terror, and the joy onto the field, you could, like, summon Morpheus, attack, tag into Black Knight, attack, tag back into Light Morpheus, and attack. Because uh, each of their effects are once per turn, so you could tag and tag and tag. Yeah. Uh, it's the same for the Dream Mirrors. The Dream Mirrors at the end of the turn can banish themselves for the other Dream Mirror. But um, once you get that other Dream Mirror, you can banish that also for the Terror again. It's just, it's once per turn. Yeah. And also, heads up to you guys using this deck. If you use the uh, the trap card that gives your opponent a field spell to you, do not give them Dream Mirror Terror. You're supposed to have that. Yeah, Terror is a better one. So both of them have an effect. So Terror, while you control a Dark Monster, inflicts 300 to your opponent every time they special summon. Uh, Joy, while you have a light monster, makes it so your opponent can only attack your highest level monsters. Uh, Joy, Terror is a more useful one, so you probably want Terror on your field and Joy on there. And I believe you also can't target the, your monsters, right? With light? Uh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, yeah, you can only target their highest level monsters for effects, which, in theory, sounds good, but the light ones are honestly the worst, because they have no op they have no offense. With the except, the only good ones, honestly, uh, Sprite. Ah, I mean, a sprite, a friend, sprite and friend both now. of them are good. It's just their, this is their high level one isn't good, which is the problem. Yeah. Isn't that good? Of course, you know when it comes to you just have, oh no, I like Dreamer ones. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna get into dueling before we talk about you know the deck hole video. Yeah, I apologize. Right. I just you know because I wanted to talk about the one of the you know the the hype TCGR type. How long did that take us? <laughs> Six minutes. Wow. Yeah, so I think that's the longest we've just got. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm, I'm probably, I'm probably gonna put like a timestamp or something. Say, hey, skip, skip to like part seven. Skip like six minutes. I think you want to go first. Yeah, man. I feel like this is going for a sec. Hey, you fucking open up, uh, BLS boy. Yep, but I didn't open up a mirror, so not mm. good. <laughs> yep. Like I said, very reliant on first, but in fact, I should just throw that terraform into the deck. Uh, no, yes. You should also probably throw, um, you can probably throw Metaverse. Oh, wait, Metaverse is only at one now. Doesn't matter. I'm just going to grab the Dark Knight when I need it. And I always set, uh, I've set my good Dark Boy, because he's a good boy. <laughs> he's going to protect my life points. Let's see what happens. Ooh, uh, what specials from deck? Eh, I don't negate it. I'd rather not face down a, uh, Crystal Wind. Oh, oh no! Nagels. Oh. I never wanted to see this R type again. <laughs> it's like you guys were hit. Just, just fucking die. I have a PTSD about this thing. Oh, it's Me like and this. a tier mirror match these so many times. You know, just just because the tier wanted to try it. I'm like, oh my gosh. It was. And now, and now, like playing against it so much. This is very prevalent back when Kieran was around. It's like, oh. Yeah, I can imagine. Like uh, I remember hearing this deck was. Really cancerous, and I think I fought it at locals once and uh, hated it. Yeah, it's definitely not as powerful without the you know with the extra monsters. You can't just well back then they could get their cards right, and then you'd wipe, and then even if you could wipe the board, all five of the monsters come back. Yeah, which is one thing that I'm. Ha uh, and then when they special summon, they get the freaking cards, and then it's like going to I have more spell on traps. So they had infinite resources. Now the effect wouldn't be that bad. Yeah, uh, I might be better off if I had you know. Put them in attack mode. Well, yes, but I mean, if I had a mirror, you know, I probably would have a more solidified board. Yeah, I mean, but I'm just hoping I draw a terror or hypnogia or trap trick. Yeah. Or well, something good. <laughs> if you draw a trap trick, I think you might lose. Also, put the thing on normal chain. Uh, no, if I draw a trap trick, I okay. put. If I draw a trap trick, I would put uh, terror and joy, and I would just summon Agglos. And then when then I would just tag her out for Mara, especially with some info, and then. Okay. But. Um, Speaking of foe. I mean, he has. I uh, mean, he's he's goodest boy. He wants to show that he's goodest boy. I'm gonna attack the fox man. Is the fox one the worst one to get to get rid of? I don't know. <laughs> Actually, I don't remember a lot of their effects. I don't know. Cat was good. Raccoon was really good. I don't remember what Foxy Boy does. He adds a trap. Okay. I think, uh, I think Raccoon, like, adds, a, like, a monster, right? Raccoon adds a, uh, s yeah, monster. Okay. Yeah, I remember, I remember that Bunbuku was, uh, fucking annoying. It's like, oh boy, can't be targeted or destroyed by card effects. Why None of them they? can. That's why Kirin was so stupid and had to be banned. It was hard enough to kill him, and then he could bounce shit. But wasn't he mostly also, wasn't he bad? Wow, of course he has three. 
Wasn't he mostly banned because he was in, uh, he was using Monarchs or some shit? Uh, Penelums. Penelums in general took advantage of him. Mm. And because he couldn't be targeted or destroyed, I think, by card effects, he was nearly unstoppable. And then when you try to, and like, even if you try to beat over him, you know, he's just bouncing your shit. And then against decks like this that run the back row, you know, you couldn't solidify a good enough board to get over Kieran. And then I think, uh, I'm trying to remember what the good Penelum deck at the time that took advantage of him was. Was it Pepe? And, yeah, it was probably Pepe. Or magicians in general. It was a it was a variant of the deck that got him banned. Mm. The but, fuck is traffic go? Oh, so it's as if a vanilla rate like. Uh, yeah, but anyway, the point is like Penlums in general got him hit. He should have trimmed that over here. He would have had the three zones. I don't think he was thinking that through. Well, he's overlaying, so I guess it doesn't matter that much. He's overboring, if you get what I mean. Okay. Cool story, bro. It just pop it's just an MST. Yeah, I know. Hey! Hi. And it's not a quick effect without having um uh, what you can call it. Water. Yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mara. Oh, I think going to do a Morpheus. Could you also not go into um, BLS and fuck his day up? Yes, I can now go into BLS as well. I'm gonna hit his um, centric. Uh, what can I. Oh, okay, so that's my link. Oh, and I can also open it, but I'm gonna yeah. do that. Do, 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 do. He attack again in a row right now. Oh, just he can attack yeah, again. Yeah, I'm gonna kill this with that. BLS so it's more damage. No, it has to attack again. In a row oh, right it now. was in a row. Okay. Yeah, oh well. I'm, I'm like, yeah, doesn't it? It's all right. I don't think I had game regardless. I mean, I had closer you, to game. Oh, can't you um tag out? Can't you tag out Mara for um Ikelos now? Or, oh wait. Like, no, I need joy. Yeah. Hey. Um, mm -hmm. I'm thinking if I overlay. Yeah, actually, no. Against this deck, I do overlay for um, Harbinger here. Okay, keep in mind, he also has um, the uh, he has the, um, the Tornado face down. Uh, which one is it? Match Vector Tornado. Uh, tribute one wind spell cast a monster, then target one monster your opponent controls, banish it. Okay, then, you know, actually, I will keep this for Yeah, that's what I'm like, because I saw him add that, I'm like, just be careful. And we're going to pop Troy in. That gives all my monsters a nice boost. Now, good boy, stronger. <laughs> good boy, friend. Wow, this dude June does. F okay. Oh, and then you can just tag out if he's gonna pop one. If he's gonna pop one of your cards, right? Yeah. Actually, wait. You can also do it now that um you can tag out, and then if you get um Morpheus on board, it prevents him from targeting. Oh wait, that's right. Tornado doesn't target. Now, hold on, watch this. Let's see if he negates this. He did. So now I get this. Oh, now, now the force to attack. Uh, oh, we sorry, one crystal. No, 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 look. Because now um, I'm going to tag him out and get this back, and I'm going to pop his tuner when he summons oh. it. Uh, yeah, we'll use White Knight's effect because I don't have a reason not to use his effect. <laughs> that should just that should just be um, it activates. Not you get a choice to activate it. Honestly. Nah, I just need him special from that bell, and I'll use um, Toad. Set one from his deck. Hmm. That's fine. I'll just chain. Uh, I just think Darker Boy because he's a good boy. So he's gonna get it. That's fine. You know what? It's better that yeah, I think it's better that he negates that. Yeah, I still have a search, so I'm still relatively fine. Although I do need to get a uh, sprite on the board before he summons Crystal Ring. I have to add a hand, right? Yeah. What are you gonna get out? Hmm. I could just smack Crystal Wing with Fantasy anyway. 
So I might just search that. Although, no, I might want to search a play enabler. I'm going to have Joy, so I might want to just search. Uh, oh, no, I used my phone. Mm -hmm. hmm. I could also search a dark mirror. Do you really need dark, dark mirror? mirror right now? I could just search this for next turn. It's fine. And I get extra boosts. I think it, I believe they stack, so. Maybe. We'll see. So now you gotta destroy, uh, or you're gonna, um, tag out into something to get rid of his, uh, tuner? Well, I was, but he negated, uh, uh foe. Oh, foe uh, was no, my play. No, I thought you could do, oh, that's right, I was thinking of, um, I thought Morpheus could, uh, tag out, that's right. For some reason, I was just thinking about that. I mean, you still swing into him, honestly? Uh, he gains my attack. Oh, does he? Yeah, it's first ring. I tend to forget that. I'm pretty sure I can't be destroyed. So yeah. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> can we curse me again real quick? Oh, actually, that works too. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get dark. No, 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 you stay there, Terror. Cool. <laughs> it's not you oh, can no, link. Yeah. Or Axes. Yes, I guess we'll add one Dream Mirror Monster. Oh, you probably had Foe. Yeah. Or not Foe, um, Friend, I should say. Yeah, I don't have a Dark, I don't have Foe to tag out into, though. Oh, God. Yeah, oh, I'm sorry. probably gonna add, uh, Morphous. And then I'm gonna bait him with Horror Effect. He negates her effect, then I just banish it with BLS. Okay. No call by the grave. You're not going to save me in this situation. No. Is that no? <laughs> <laughs> now that's gone. Actually, no, I wish I didn't add it, but whatever. Hmm. Hmm. And could you swing into him with Morpheus, tag out, and then uh, do it again? Oh, no. Because I searched him like it. Oh. Times. Yeah. I probably should have actually went fantasy. It, it well, happens. you know, it happens. I'm trying to think. Because now I'm actually... Hold on. Uh, what, what's, what's in your grave? Or, um, extra deck, I'm sorry. That I could summon right now? These. So. What's what's Fogren? Fogren? Uh, he can negate a monster and make a card unaffected by other card effects. Oh, okay. He might be my next turn play. I mean, I banished. I can attack. I could also go Felgrin and just swing here. Hmm. Wait, do I have... It, <laughs> oh, okay. He's probably like, he's taking too long. I am taking, I was taking too long, but I was thinking of my options, sorry. I mean... Um, yeah. I'm probably gonna... Put another one? Yes, I definitely want another one of this, and I definitely want another Morpheus. Having having the extra ones of these help go into these, I might also want three friends. Jesus Christ. But your deck is just your deck is so packed as it is though. Yes, I know. I'm gonna have to um I have to make arrangements essentially. And give up some things. I'll see take out B take out BLS to one. Yeah. I'm gonna have to drop this. I mean I don't want to, but unfortunately. And just run at forty five. I mean it, that's just the problem, right? I just got stopped there. I'm hoping part of Avarice comes up to ban this, because part of Avarice would actually solve that problem. Yeah. Well, let's see how this one works. Well, obviously, I can't remove this hair, and I kind of don't want to remove any of this down here. I mean, I could remove Fantasy if I really had to. And... If you had to, but I mean, Fantasy is just... No, Fantasy's, fantasy's pretty good. Is what I want to say, but we didn't even get to use it. I mean, no, no, no. It's, as you mentioned before, Dream Mirrors have so many tech options that it's hard to, you know, figure out they, what you want. They have so many tech options that they need in their deck. And, but they also need, like, three of everything they have, yeah. otherwise the deck just, uh, the deck falters fairly easily. Oh, no. Okay, there we go. Okay. Oh, no, mirror and open hand. That sucks, as always. I'm gonna just have to add a tear from What the me. fuck is that thing? Oh, uh, Dimantium. Is this dude running fucking, um, Time Thieves? Yeah, more than likely. Yeah, I mean, he's running Dolphin, so. Or he's just, yeah, Time Thieves. I mean, 
uh, essentially a rank four toolbox. But he's not wearing uh, the little like cloud check tiger um, yellow Martin <laughs> yellow Martin uh, thing. Oh, who's a good boy? Oh boy, what do you steal, monsters? Stop, Eagleos. Ridiculous. I mean, my only real play. You can also, just set him. Mm. Don't really have a lot of options, unfortunately. Yeah. I think it's also because your deck is a little bit clogged right now. Yeah, I mean, that's just part of playtesting, is getting cards out of my deck and... Redo our... Cool. wonder what he stole this time. Another monster. Fall. Oh, you're still a friend. No, good boy! See, uh, that's really... <laughs> All monsters, that's, uh, that's a big problem I'm having with this deck. And another the monster. Another monster. He's so Morpheus. I mean, yeah, but I now I don't have any friends. The Morpheus from the graveyard. Mm. Uh, and there goes the mirror. No way. Terror, was right? It? Yeah, you think he's, I think he's still terror. Is it? He, oh, he's, he's, something, he's on Beazle ship. Oh god, damn it! You you could have said yeah, and you want to check something. Because that, that that last match popped up saying, "Would you like check? Would you like to check the fields?" Nah, at least the dude's not taking it for fucking ever. Well, he doesn't have to. I can't do anything. True. Which is uh, the problem with this deck. Can't do anything without the damn mirrors. <laughs> so can we please unlimit uh, terraforming? Phantasm's thing can help me here. I think he stole another one. Oh no, it's so okay. Now he's terror. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. No. <laughs> uh. What? Okay. I'll take it. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I'll oh, take that one too. Do this shit again. Oh, he's close out. Awesome. Bottom right. Bottom right. To right. This little white bar right here. Click that. There you go. The Fuck is that? That just opens up the desktop. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. Um, we have to run. To you have to run. <laughs> There's to no room. other choice. I'm sorry. Fantasy's a dead draw without having any mirrors, and that's the deck's problem right now. Is I'm not drawing mirrors. Yeah. I might also consider just dropping chaos to one. Mm, isn't it searchable too? It is searchable. Um, nothing else. Um, drop drop phantasm because that card hasn't really helped because you can't really use it without uh you know. Like, it's also dead without the fucking mirrors. Well, but this gives me any monster. Oh, God. I can get any of the ones I need in my hand, which is useful. And it's sort of... There, 44, let's try this. <laughs> oh, you're in the EU again. Much like Google, yeah. Hmm. Actually, was Austria part of the EU? I don't think so, right? I think it was. It was in Asia. Oh, that's from I have I have trap trick. This would have been better going for it. Trying DMs and a do do. Okay, then he's gonna do that. Spell draw two. Okay, okay so he's book. running spellbook. For so you know, put normal chain on again because you know. Oh yeah. Actually, he might just be running spellbook. Maybe. I'll see. Because this just supports spellcasters to be fair. So. Yeah, it looks like he's just running uh, spelly books. Okay, um, take this pumpkin. It's kawaii. Indeed. I don't even know what the fuck Spellbook of Life does. Just they reborns a monster from the graveyard by banishing a monster, and the monster reborn gains a level. The level is equal to the monster banished. Okay. Is it 2013? Wait, why is he using power? This is his first turn. I mean, if he's just doing the recycle master, it's kind of pointless. Could just recycle power. 
Oof. Oh, okay. Well, at least he explained it to me. <laughs> well, that's not a bad idea. Fucking. Yeah, and it goes back to the hand. That's pretty good. I like that. Okay, so we have Oh, yeah. Trap trick. You can also set um, set set mirrors or dream ki- dream mirror chaos. chaos. Yeah. I would say summon out foe. No sprite because sprite gives me um, Mara and then Mara, especially oh, when sprite yeah. sprite searches and then you, uh, and then I can tag. Or I could special out foe f- and you know yeah, then yeah, I could yeah, go yeah. friend. It e- either way you know. Anyway, the point is, I want to do this. Uh, I kind of want to do it before you did that. Look. I don't know why I didn't let you. Okay. Uh, to your fields. Okay. So yes, terror and then Troy. Lo, it stops him. Yep. Three in hand. I didn't see it reveal three. Okay, I mean that's fine. I'm just gonna tag her before I get popped. Which I probably should have waited. But that's fine because I could tag more out anyway. Yes. We can get good boy. Dark good boy. Who's good boy? <laughs> and then um and then if you attempt to pop you just use fucking um Yeah, then I'll I'll tag one or the other out depending on who he targets. I was also because you also choose um, the fusion so he can lose his target. Yeah. I gotta do a few things to be fair. Yeah. Did I show him target something yet? Actually, he's probably gonna target food spot to be fair. Yep. Yep, he targeted Terra. Which, um. Kinda sucks. Doesn't hurt me as much, actually. <laughs> oh, okay. Because uh, I can still tag out because he has Troy. And I could just trap trick another Hypnogia. I'm trying to think if I want to tag out for friend here then, or just wait. I could do a few plays if I wanted to. Mm. Yeah, let's wait. He probably he probably didn't want to take that through and burn every time. She, I'm gonna, I am gonna tag out here. I'm trying to think because the big thing about this deck and something I'm really not doing correctly is um, timing your tag outs. Well, so now I'd want to do this. And then we're gonna get Morpheus to hand. What did he add back to his hand, by the way? Uh, With Eternity? Mm. And a main phase? Uh, no, I'll let him go to battle phase. Yes. Oh, and then you like, use the ones in your uh, graveyard, I think. As, yeah, I have to use hand. a dark one too. Um, no, no, keep ones in your hand, and then what you can do is you tribute your um, tribute, no tribute him because when you have the fusion monster on board, one one. Yes, I know, but I have to use one in my hand. I know. Do you want me to use this one? No, no, no. So I'm just saying, like, uh, no, no, it doesn't matter. I was saying, like, you because I thought you were yeah. trying to. Yeah, I, I, I was planning on tributing him. You're correct. Okay, okay see, that's that was my play. Yes. Okay, see but that. you said keep the ones in your hand, and I'm like, no, well, no, then no, what no, do you no, want no. me to do? I'm sorry. See, I'm I'm just <laughs> dumb. I don't want you to activate uh, yeah. Hypnogia. Hypnogia? Oh, two. Oh, and then you're, you're trying to just get pop his board? Yep. get the white mirrors affecting him. This is not on my field. Mm. Oh, actually, no, that's fine. Uh, their effects aren't once per turn, do you remember? Or uh, are they? They're all once per turn, I believe. Uh, yes, each effect. Okay, just making sure. Because I was thinking of just trap tricking out under the Hypnogia and... <laughs> okay. Just tagging. Oof. 
Well, that's right, you couldn't uh, tag out, that's right, that's right. Unless you used a Hypnogia. White back. Just making sure, because I know sometimes it's a bit, uh. Yeah. Do I still have a Morpheus in deck? I don't think I've used them, right? Yeah, so it's just every good. Uh, I know, I know that's your last Ecolos, though. Yeah. Do I still have a. Okay, I do still have a Dark, at least, to attack. I have a Thin Hand, especially, man, unfortunately. I wish I did. Did she do what? But yeah, it's, a, it's something that's special summon. Oh, okay. With uh, Mora. And then I'll tag him out. For dark. You gonna pop anything or no? Uh, nah, because I don't want to pop the mirror. Yeah, see, so I was uh, curious. Just gonna swing for damage. Thinking if I just go into, um, you know, Mora. Do an extra five. Kind of sucks you drew. And I could go into White Knight too. But so I could pop. Deal. Well, I do an extra Dowsing and I could pop a card during his turn. Okay. He might as well. I mean, unless he has his Dirt Field spell in hand and he, he replaces mine. Wait, would you be able to pop something? Because I think you have your other Morpheus in Grave. I should have added three in the deck. Remember? I should have three Morpheus now in the deck. Oh, shit. That's right. That's right. And then I'll set that. I could just grab it in permanence at the. No, I want to keep Terror. Right so yeah, I'm just grab one right now. I'll be able to activate it this turn. Mm -hmm. Probably hindsight should replace it somewhere. Center. But I mean, he could have just you know placed anything anywhere. Yeah, I wouldn't have honestly mattered too like much. Like you, yeah. See, went in the center. You could just put it there. I just wish I didn't draw two Ikalas because then I could banish search. You know. Yeah. A better. Yeah, you know what? I don't think I want him to. Does it matter? Because he also has, um, what's, what's your face in hand? Aruru. If he Arurus me and targets, let's say, him, I just tag out. Okay. And then I pop Aruru. Making sure. He's, it looks like he's also thinking about this. It's like, hmm. If he sends her back to hand. <laughs> I guess. Like, why would he target Mara, though? <laughs> I don't know. Well, anyway, I don't think he'd be able to because he, I think he, he has to target, um, he has to target, uh, Morpheus. No. Actually, I think it's an eight card on the field. Okay, so he wants to banish that. You mean, uh, return to hand? Yeah, that's what I meant. He's banishing it to my hand. That's what I said. So does he have the cold of the grave in hand? Oh, okay. I guess it's just lagging. It's, yeah, it's probably just processing the chain. Ha! Still took that 300, bitch. Your opponent received 300 damage. You want to use a card effect? Yes, I do. <laughs> do you have another one in hand or something? Or fate? This is a very interesting exchange. What does fate do? Oh. He, yes. <laughs> Non-targeting <laughs> removal. It's one of the stupidest spell books. I it's saying you just go to Link Rebel, that's it. Yeah. Now, see, wow, this actually kind of sucks. Yeah, yeah, see, something like Avarice would help this deck. Part of Avarice, if it exists. I'm just going to crash into his blue boy, because he needs spellcasters for some of his spell books. Not all of them, but then some set, of them. Uh, yeah, so if he summons blue boy, he's losing his blue boy. Or even, even if he has something else, like, which, of course, he can't. Hey, that works. See, I still have... Yes? yes! I should still okay, have a, so in other words, you got game on him. Yeah, I'm like, I should still have a Dark Good Boy in deck. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Dark Good Boy. His bark hurts more than his bite. And then we get Light Good Boy. And then Light Good Boy is like, bark us. No, get, no, and then you get... You get yeah, so you get Ecolus out. Yep. <laughs> See, and then here would be like, the best point to search this. 
and then I use it and, you know, I have her. But I'm just going to kill him with Light Good Boy, because he's a good boy. <laughs> there you okay. go. No, like, no joke, that was actually a good one. Yeah. Yeah, when I actually had my torch powers for more than half the game. <laughs> no, I was mean like a chosen of interactions too. Like, oh yeah, I know it was good. Yeah, in general, it was a good duel. Which I like having duels like that. One side duels are boring regardless of um, if yeah. you have the one sided matchup or if they have the one sided matchup. Yeah. I mean, it's fun at first for you, and you're like, oh, I wrecked this kid, and it's like, eh, I wrecked this kid. Yeah. Speaking of power avers. <laughs> <laughs> no, we got yeah. like ten of them. Yep, Ooh, also, I'm going first. Also, I found I found more on uh, more on my binder. Go, go for it, dark good boy. <laughs> oh, he's a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> fucking cicada! I swear to God. <laughs> it kind of sucks that this entire deck loses to Ash Blossom, though. <laughs> yeah, every day, every card in this deck has loses to Ash Blossom. Except for, like... Oh, it's Dinos. Okay, um, well, I don't actually think I have a response to that anyway, so... <laughs> Not yet, at least. Okay. Okay, cool. Huh. Now I have a draw egg token. Joke's on him. Now That's like, extra defense for me. No, no. Now we have Link, Link Rebo fodder. I'm going to tribute that. Tribute some Morpheus to not gain his effect. What's he targeting? The mirror, probably? Oh, no. That's the target monster. Oh, yeah. No, no, then he, and then he prevents the destruction yeah, using this. And then he would send the... Then he would destroy the baby Sarasaurus in his deck. Then he gets the special summon and the uh, blink other card from his deck. Do you have Trap Trick and One Face down? Uh, oh. Chaos. Yes. yes. Chaos and invade. Got it. Soul eating over raptor. God, miscellaneous source never come off. Should have never come off the fucking ban list. To be fair, he hasn't used it on me yet. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I just like don't. I do not like dinos. No, on an honest level, do you feel Prankatops is a little too good for what he does? Let's see. Isn't he a little special summon tribute to Pop? Yes, he's a better Cyber Dragon. And 2600 attack. I feel like that's where he actually drives him up. He's 2600 attack. But I mean, at the same time, he feels balanced. He doesn't feel like, oh god, this guy's so broken. But he feel, but he does feel like he's good. He's a little too good for what he does. Especially because also he probably shouldn't have been generic, right? Shouldn't he yeah. have just been like, if, if you get, control a Dino Wrestler card, right? Or like reveal a Dino Wrestler in hand besides Pranker Tops. Yeah. Because for Dino Wrestlers, it'd be good, because Dino, Dino Wrestlers need the, all the support yeah. they can get, because they're kind of bad. Wolf. Okay, Dugalus. He can, he can double attack of a uh, monster on his field, skip his next battle phase, or discard, uh, or draw two discard one, or special on a monster from his GY. Wait, what did he do? Uh, I didn't see. I think he's doubling the attack. We're about to find out. Maybe. Someday. Yep, double the, he doubled the attack of... Uh, awesome. Okay. That's cool. So he plans. He just plans to swing into... Uh... Oh yeah, Nurse could pop him. How am I going to pop him? Could you pop him Morpheus? How am I going to special him Morpheus? I'm stupid. <laughs> Hello, friend. I'm friend. Oh, who's a good friend? Actually, I shouldn't do that because he gets an extra attack. Because <laughs> I'm not. So... Mhm. Mm <laughs> I mean, you could fusion summon. <laughs> yes, I could fusion summon and lose my fusion monster. Mhm. Mm I was actually planning on fusion summoning at his end phase. Well, even if I mess up by summoning this, I still technically take less damage than I would have taken from a seven thousand to a fourteen hundred monster. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And he skips his next battle phase, so that's good for me. Yeah. Gives me a chance to draw something. And then lost, with the Lost World, he can just prevent destruction, right? Uh, prevent destruction of a dinosaur monster, I believe. That, by right. send, by destroying the dinosaur monster in his hand or deck. Okay. Uh, would be destroyed by a card effect if you destroyed that many dinosaur monsters in your hand and or deck instead. 
Okay, so, so... So I'm probably popping this first if I summon... Or if you get Dreamy or Fantasy out. I don't have Fantasy in the deck anymore, remember? Oh, yeah! Or I would have probably trap-tricked it. <laughs> that, too. Actually, when Hopster can get rid of a Hypnogia, what am I talking about? What's up? I'm just going to Hypnogia him at end phase. <laughs> That'll get rid of the third spell for me. Probably not letting you activate. I have to wait for him to. Oh, okay. Yes. Have another response. Give yourself uh, terror. Terror, yeah. You... Wait, am I missing? Oh, right, I already banished terror. Yes. I was like, am I missing a terror? No, terror, don't banish yourself. Yeah, that actually kind of works. It's still fine. I fuse my two good boys together. To make the goodest boy. That'd be funny if one of these monsters was actually um something like that. Oh, you can just put your monster face down. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's yes, tribute. Whatever. Right? <laughs> mm -hmm. He can attack me next turn. Which is good. Gives me a chance to draw something, like I said. Yeah, if you draw the Ekalos or Mara. They're who I need the most, actually. Or even uh, phantasms. Or, or uh, my, yeah, my good boys, too, will help me a lot. Yeah. Probably would work to you if you'd send Morpheus from your hand to fusion summon. I, I just, I thought about it after I banished the materials and my like, gas yeah, sort of. That way you would have been in the graveyard for me to, uh... To special summon. Yeah, to special summon if, uh... Well, then or if Or if King died, I would have had a target to special summon from the graveyard. Yeah. Namely, I probably would have brought back, uh, you know... Wait, oh damn it. I was like, yeah, what? Ah, you were just distracted, who cares? Well, call me give that one instead. Yep. I never remember what that card does. Oh, well, it makes his dinosaurs unaffected by card effects. Oh, cool. Or unaffected by your effects, I should say. Then banish any by dinosaurs from his grave during cleaning the card, especially on one dino from his deck with a level equal to the total number of monsters you attributed. Uh, huh. But, but blow it up during it. Oh, hey! There we go. See, and that's right around the set through. <laughs> yes, I will add a Dream Arrow monster. Um, Let's see. Yeah, I should just start with Sprite and then go into Morrow. Morrow gives me um, Sir okay. Dude. I flip her. Oh, yeah, and then you'll be able to... Uh, Pop, yes. Unless well, she should... wants to respond right now. Which he probably shouldn't. No more summon. Actually, it wouldn't matter if he responds. You just you still tribute. I off. yes, I tribute now. Oh, oh, <laughs> god. Is he gonna get rid of though? Both of them for. Oh, like Mud Dragon. Yeah, or something. Actually, no, he, he can't get rid of both of them for Mud Dragon. They're the same attribute and type. No, they're not. Yes, they are. Oh yeah, they're, they're both like both. fairies. Oh yeah. <laughs> And then I believe he can make uh, he can make one of his uh, he can make my dragon's uh, attribute change and I believe it's not during my turn. It's not quick effect. Really? That was quick effect. Nope. Oh no, it yeah, is. Yes, that's a quick effect. Hmm. You know what? You're actually still stronger than uh, his Tyranno. Yep, I am. Oh, that's right. I don't think it'd be destroyed now, right? Like, I think that's what he does. He... I thought he prevents targeting, doesn't he? Yeah, I kind of target monsters in the field, but I already targeted it, so... Okay. It uh, should go off. Shouldn't go I, off. Yeah. Oh, no, I still pop it. <laughs> I was like, is, is he light? He is light. Now he has a response. Cool. He's going to put your monsters face down. Yes, I know. I think if I just tag for the sake of... Keeping your tagging. monsters. No, I mean just for the sake of like tagging her in the very least, because uh, I haven't used a uh, the other one search. Okay. They all go face down regardless because he's using it as a chain link. Sure. I don't get the search. Oh well. Oh well. He still lost Skinner Trano, and now he's top decking. So let's see if I'm not the most unlucky bastard in the world. Because I have advantage right now, as long as I don't. As long as you can summon a monster. 
Okay. Or regardless, bro, actually, you're attacking her micro for me, but. Okay. I don't think it hurt as much as, uh... Oh, hey, would you look at that? Yeah. If someone was <laughs> paying attention to what my defense was when I went face down. To be fair, I don't... To be fair, I also would have forgotten about that. No, I don't need to do any tagging yet. Okay. Hey, goodest boy. Oh, good boy. See, he always comes to me when, when I need a win. <laughs> to attack mode, we flip her face up. Also, you have to beat into him with Ecolos for a game. Do I have enough damage to do that? I think I do. Wait, which Ecolos? Mara. Or, um, Sprite. Or, you know, both. Wait, why don't you have him attack directly? Oh, you can just tag him. Because, I'm just gonna, because, yeah, I'm just going to kill him and start tagging out. It doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. It doesn't matter how I do this order. He's going to take about 10 times. I have to kill Mud Dragon and attack directly. True. Always thinking about using the effect. Okay. Deek. Wow. That hits like a fucking truck. Phantasm actually makes him strong. Oh yeah, see? That's why I like the card. It helps with the food spells, and it switches any monster. So, it's not completely dead without the food spells. Still, you know, not the best sometimes, but... Yeah. It's not enough. I mean, you still tag out, you still tag out again into uh, Mara the game. <laughs> Sometimes you need to effect special to add to hand. Oh yeah, I, I, I mean, I'm killing him this turn. Because <laughs> I still have a Dark Knight tag. <laughs> so I won no matter what this yeah. turn. And I have a good boy tag too. <laughs> there we go. Oh, you know what you should have found in the deck? Gaga -ga -ga Cowboy. Oh, he said GG. There's really to find people in YGO Pro who say GG. You know what? And it's like, it's like <laughs> good job. <laughs> GJ, that was actually very good. Yes. See, th this is like the high point of the deck. You get Hypnogia, and then you can start controlling the board very slowly. I, I mean, I'm surprised I got around that super poly. To be fair. <laughs> yeah, how long has it been? Oh, uh, yeah, let's check. Oh, I, oh, yeah, I'm off right at it a little bit more. Yeah. Just because, you know, we did, uh... We, probably, like, we, we, we went back and did that. Let's do one more. Yeah. I like this archetype enough to try to at least get another win with it. You've got, like, what, After two, two losses. Yeah, two losses, two wins. So let's see if I... Let's see if I fall more towards losing or winning. Judging from how our normal videos go, <laughs> make your prediction in the comments. Uh, oh, okay. shit, we're back against Double God. <laughs> Well, I boost the god and god. <laughs> but it, but is he a kawaii pumpkin? <laughs> uh, I still love that scene in Pocket Mirror. <laughs> it was so out of the blue, but it's like, you know it, what? It has nothing to do with the game. You don't even get pumpkin charms from that. <laughs> it literally had nothing to do with it. <laughs> Not a guy, Rock. Rock, I believe you. Oh, you're correct. Hey! I we just don't have any something. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I just hold off this turn. Uh, yeah, I guess. Just, just yeah, like twins. Yeah, I think I just hold off. We're doing a very pro set one pass. I mean, as long as I draw a good boy or an Iclo, some good. Yeah. Okay. Cool, cool story, bro. It's a dream hero mirror match. Oh. The fuck is that? Oh, wait, he's uh, extra brawler burial. He's trying Necros then? Megalith, maybe? Actually, I could see Megalith. Mm -hmm. You know, I thought about running that card in a uh, level one deck with Karibos, and I was gonna extra burial Quasar and Berserker Crush. Oh no! Yeah, that would that'd be more of a meme video though, and do that. Because I was gonna have Cap Shell on the deck, but not being level one, <laughs> I was gonna use it to ritual summon Relinquish. <laughs> and then because it was tributed, I'll draw a card. You know, making Cap Shell broken. Oh, it is Megalith. Yep, it's Megalith. Oh, uh, banish him? Yeah, actually, that would be. Wow, that, um, hmm. I didn't think that's how that would work. That's a bad interaction for the deck if you think about it. 
He's running incantations. Yeah, just see incantations. Yeah, but like I said, I don't know how much I like that. Like, what does an incantation do for me that a manja and a senju already really doesn't do? It doesn't waste your normal summon, and you add more stuff you can use to such summon out. Okay, in a deck of all ritual monsters, what am I normal summoning? Y- your ritual monsters, of course. <laughs> Because then I have to go based on, one, I have to add in the nine more incantation cards. Then I have to worry about drawing the incantation card that gives me a ritual spell card, because obviously I don't have ritual spell cards. Uh, I don't need that one. No, they have, they have ritual spell. Oh, yeah, that's right, because Portal is actually the... Uh, Portal is a field spell. They don't have ritual spells. Their monsters do their ritual summoning. Mm. So that's why I was like, a monster in a sense that already searches the monsters is all I need. I don't need the incantations. I don't need the extra special summons, to be fair. Honestly, I was thinking about destroying like Talismandra and uh, Candle just because they're the only good ones. Yeah. Because I don't, I don't like Bookstone and uh, uh, Pensa Bloom too much just because they yeah. have to rely on you in Crave, which... Well, like I said, you saw my deck. I was already... I had, like, 30 monsters. <laughs> no, if, if nothing else, add Chalice Slime. He searches any of your fucking rituals, so just by revealing it. Yeah. I think so, he did at least. No, yeah, I think he searches incantations. And then your incantations get your ritual stuff. Or he might also have to reveal an incantation card. Which I'm not sure can or cannot be him. Okay, ben 10 is alright, actually. I do like that idea. Yeah, that's actually pretty cool. See, Ben 10 sir. I, I honestly thought he was going to search out uh, Manatee's Ruler. Yeah. Or Vanity's Ruler, because I'm so used to fucking Necros doing that crap. Oh, looks like someone's going to shatter. Oh, Cerubius. I like this already. This is actually very interesting. Can, do they ritual summon anything? Oh, no, okay. They just make it less. Okay. I was making sure I'm like, that would actually be very interesting if they ritual summon anything. Hmm. Oof. When I didn't really need that. Um, oh, okay, yeah. The one time I didn't need Hypnagia. Oh, I get rid of his food spell, so I guess it's still fine. I really need a monster um, on my searching no, card. I would, I would set, set your um, set that face down. Chaos. Yeah, that we can. Uh, you activate Hypnogia, and then you could uh, activate that to fuse from your hand. Yeah, I mean that's fair. As is the fusion doesn't do much without, you know, for effect to. Oh, oh no, I guess well, I could bring back the knight. So yeah, that's fair. Exactly. That that's See that way. Good. Like I know, I know it's not an optimal, an optimal, but it's still something like as a just in case. <laughs> it's more optimal than half the things this deck does. So mm-hmm. yeah, once you have to attract it. Oh yeah, I can just activate now. I was actually gonna read what he what his requirement is. <laughs> uh, so you can reveal this card, discard one card, and if you use person one and can, okay, so he just gets an incantation out of your deck by discarding a card. I mean, obviously, I don't think this is. I don't think they're that bad. I just you know. I kind of just feel like Kamandra and Sentry do most of the things. I mean, obviously, special summoning this one using a uh, Chalice Slime. Slime, getting your Ritual Monster, and then you can still normal summon a Monster who also has good an extra surge. Yeah. So, I mean, it's not that bad. But obviously, he's running kind of an interesting. I mean, I don't know how I was going to run the deck, but I was going to do all Megalits to try all the Megalits. He's probably just running like a Ritual select Slam. few reg- Megalits and then more Ritual. I mean, hey, I mean, that's so cool. I mean, yeah. I like I like seeing. I, like I mean, seeing it would probably end up being an optimal way of running the deck compared to how I'm going to run it with like. I want to use all the Megalith cards. Gotta catch them all, Megalith Mon. <laughs> yeah, I can't use uh, what's that? What's that old ass rock monster that you gain? Uh, bash all rocks from a graveyard. You gain 700 attack for each bash rock monster. It almost went in my deck. <laughs> Mega Rock Dragon. I'm like, hmm. I could run Mega Rock Dragon. <laughs> I used to run that stupid um, um, mer- magical merchant. Mm-hmm. And then you would use it, and you'd mill your all the rock monsters in your deck, <laughs> and then you would summon a mega rock dragon, uh, and go for a game. It was a uh, you know glass cannon. You either won or you lost that turn, like oh, the Benke my, deck. Yeah, like my, I was saying, like my, like the Benke <laughs> deck. Except when I play a gadget, because you always draw into your mirror, your gadget go go gadget mirror force. Damn right, I go go gadget mirror it all over your force. Aerotron. Do I just do it now? What does this do? Because I think this... Each time we be a short battle, it's not... Battle and he part. gets to target... What yeah. ritual? So yeah, so he's rich for something. So let's just replace his first so he doesn't get his monster back, right? Yeah. So I feel like that's at least better for what I can do. Man, he can still have his monster, you know. Nothing yeah. I'm going to do about that. It just depends on what he's summoning, because obviously I think there's one that pops cards equal to the number of ritual monsters in your Speaking grave. Speaking of... Oh yeah. It's Bethior. 
If this card is ritual summon, target cards. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so he's getting this one. This one... Oh, no, this is level four. Okay. Yeah, that's some adds, I think. Yeah. But now I have a choice of chaos. Nothing else. If he, if he gets if he gets some um, Bethior around, he targets your face down, chain it, make him waste, make him waste one. Oh, he got Bethior, or Bethor. I think Bethor is gonna be one of the better ones. The other one I liked that I saw was um. But the other level eight. Yeah, there's a there's no there's three level eights, but there's a light one that um that you get your ritual monsters gain three hundred attack per ritual monster in graveyard. Mm, yeah, that would actually be fucking good. Ooh, Granite Loyalist. Yeah, it's a good card. Is he gonna search new Beardu though? Right. Think about that. My opponent last game couldn't be with me. <laughs> yeah, summoned five times during the battle phase. So he's getting Auk. Auk is the the chaos looking ones, the ones that look light and dark, are the ones with the um, quick effect ritual. Yeah. Also, he also couldn't nibir you. That guy would not have been able to nibir you because it's during the end or the main phase. Oh, it did specify main phase. Yes, okay. I remember correctly. I'll double check after this video or tell me in the comments because I know I'm probably wrong. You're probably right. Oh, hey, just look at that. I myself from battle this turn. See? That's why I said to put Chaos Face down. Yep. Yeah, you're right. Well. Targets a card you pull, plays one ritual, and then you can negate it. Okay. Yeah. Actually, that probably actually kind of forced my deck if you think about it. I do a lot of targeting. Wano doesn't do a lot of targeting? This? Yes. <laughs> I was gonna say, um. Fantasy. Yeah. I let him draw a discard. Yeah. Draw one discard or draw or as many as he used? Uh, he, it's just draw a discard. Okay, draw one discard. So it's, I was about to say, it's just Mott Man. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Well, I'll take it, I guess. we do that for the... Uh, you know what? Wait, hold on. Let me say this replay real quick. Yeah? Oh, you want to see because, what Yeah, is? I want to see what my next... No, I want to see what my next card was. See if I would have drawn a monster. If I, just, I feel like if I draw a monster, I guarantee you won that game. Okay. And then what turn was that? Just go all the way down. I have a lot of replays, man. Oh. Go up. Suck. Suck at this. <laughs> no. Yeah, give this to me. No, I refuse. I will take. I I have control of the computers. No, you could. You do not have control. Um, uh, one, turn. two, three. It was five, I think. Yeah, I'll see. I won. <laughs> I would have summoned more Gai Kylo. Search, oh, okay. search Dark Knight. Banish Dark Banish Kylo's got Mara. Was it really Kylo? Oh yeah, okay. it was Mara. Oh, he did run Vanity's Ruler. Oh, that's nasty. Oh yeah, I I liked his deck. Look Ooh. at that. He even had Shino boards. It's all it's just a pure that's, ritual deck. I like that. And of course, you know, um, that Shino board like shuffles uh, monsters. Yeah. I wonder if he ran the um. I mean, I have to go back a turn. Yeah, go to four. Go to four uh, deposit. Uh, I'll just go to. Three. It's four ways the last turn. Oh, sure. Uh, I wonder if he actually ran the ritual spells for them, though. Or if he just ran them. I guess he just ran them to discard them, but then I wonder... At that point... Oh, is that no, really... he used um, Incantation uh, Celebration. He ritual summoned anyone. Oh. Oh, okay, that's cool. Oh, does that work for the Megalids, too, then? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, maybe Incantation... Yeah, that probably work. I still... Am not now, I see, now I see what I was telling you, like, the Incantations aren't that bad. Yeah, I, I would still want to try a uh, mostly pure megalith build first, and then probably try because this is interesting because he runs a lot of just rituals. This is actually just more ritual beatdown. Hey, that's well, actually cool. I like cool. it. I like it a lot. That's yeah. cool. Cool, and we and we to show off a uh, deck profile for some guy who's running a pretty cool version of megaliths. Yep. So your next one was trap trick. Oh, I guess my next one was trap trick. Why was that turning me Mara? Yeah. Okay. Well, actually, I probably definitely didn't run that duel then. My next one was trap trick. If it was Mara, I guarantee you won that game. Yeah. Or was they doing a word shuffle thing in the replays? Oh, no, no, it was because, um, didn't we, uh... Because, no, it's, no, remember, because it was, it's, 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 you drop trick last time, remember? We actually Oh, trap. and it shuffled, yes, yes, that's right. Okay, yeah, so my next hour was Mara, so I, I probably guaranteed one that game. Uh, okay. Yeah, but let's go to the, uh, demo far real quick. Yeah. You know, I think this, uh, this build of Dream Mirrors actually worked out the best for you. Yeah, I liked it. Uh, you, know, you know, guys, we did a few editing in between the video. Well, obviously, I needed extra editing. Um, yeah, so I think three good boys, three of each good boy, only two Morpheus. So obviously, you need the extra Morpheus to tag out. Yeah. Uh, three dark Morpheus, or two he light, two. three dark. Yeah. Two would probably be also be fine, but I like the three because he's kind of your main removal. Uh, think of him as your worst dark destroyer. Yeah. <laughs> I'll say these, these, these guys are just these guys are just non pew pew ship destroyers. That's all they are. Yeah, 
And then you probably you still want the three fairies. Oh, yeah. And everything else is kind of up to you. I feel like you kind of want the trap trick for the Hypnogia because you really need the throw spells. You saw the games that didn't have the throw spells were pretty much losses. You could probably run between your things, but you, I feel like you definitely need Called by the Graves. You probably want this. You can run one or two Chaoses. Honestly, I don't think Impermanence is that great. You can probably remove... No, well, not that great. You can probably replace that for something else. You're probably right. I didn't feel like I needed Impermanence that month. I mean, I did stop that blue boy in that game, if which no, kind of helped. But, I mean, most of my monsters can dodge effects like targeting, so Impermanence is a hit. Hit or miss. But, I, I mean, if y'all want to run the deck, I like to y'all what y'all feel like. Obviously, you could take out BLS. You might not need BLS. I only used it in that first game. But he kind of helped in the first game, to be fair. Yeah. Okay, guys. But anyway, this has been an hour long, I bet. Yeah, yep. wow. <laughs> and we apologize if it took so long, but I mean, there's a lot to edit with. There's a lot to edit. There's a lot to um, check with this because th this deck needs as much support as it can get. Yeah, there might still be a lot to edit. Anyway, guys, this has been Yusha Steve. Villadre from Heroes Go Games. See you next time. Bye.